here. Awesome. Not seeing a thing that afternoon. Late morning, I should say. We've been glassing this property for a couple hours now. <clears throat> the layout of the land is, if you can kind of imagine, we have a ridge, comes down to a bowl, up to a ridge, down to a bowl, and then up again. We're kind of in that middle ridge right now, watching both the north and the south ridges. It's about 5.15 in the evening right now. We're trying to just catch some kind of movement. Last week it was dramatically cooler and we were able to capitalize on that and get a good buck down a nice three by two my buddy brian of california outdoor tv but today it was in the mid 90s so not so favorable for us deer hunters it's been a slow day but we've been hard at it all day long so we're hoping this evening's a ticket this has been a pretty good evening spot for the most part best results have occurred in the evening so we're hoping that you know we catch some movement and we can make a stock on it and Old Dave Murdoch here can capitalize, make the, put the 270 where it counts. So uh, stick with us and uh, wish us luck. I'm gonna go gather up my deer, see how uh, small it is. <laughs> Running out of light, get down on them quick. Beautiful. He's a, he's a pretty deer, man. He's better than he looked from back there, huh? Mm-hmm. Atta boy. Just a little one, but we got meat. Hey man, that's a beautiful buck, man. Thank you, Grandpa. I know you're looking down. Using my grandfather's 270. Beautiful buck, bro. You were looking for meat today and you got it. That's all I wanted was meat. Right at the end of the day, man. Thank you. Thank you.